Hi guys, sometimes you need spare parts for your RC cars, just like this WL Toys A313 body strut. So why not just 3D print them? Recently I bought this Creality CR8 3D printer. But first we have to assemble this thing. Also the enormous backlash needs to be adjusted. Unfortunately, its axes are not really square to each other. But after the power supply is removed, this can easily be fixed. The printer is now ready. The next step is to draw the part in a 3D CAD. Thanks to my job, I have access to Alibra Design. This is a professional 3D CAD. Of course, you can also use other software. Just like Fusion 360 or FreeCAD. The Cura software comes with the printer. It allows to translate the STL data into G code for the printer. So now it's time to print this part. I have used white 1.75mm PLA filament. Looks good so far. But will this part be strong enough? Here you can compare the finished part with the original one. And this is how it looks like inside the car, after a little bit of deburring. But are the parts really strong enough? To test whether or not the parts are strong enough, I have designed this A959 steering linkage. Looks good. So let's remove the access material. The next step is to mount the ball joint. Will it snap? No, looks fine. So far I'm impressed how strong this PLA material is. The linkage is now ready to mount in the car. That's it, mounted. But will they survive the test drive? Let's find out. My A979B with electronic stability control is now ready for the test drive. Looks like the linkages did survive crash number one. Yes, everything looks fine. Everything is still fine, so let's proceed with the durability test on fine gravel. My Arduino stability control system also works fine. Will the PLA rod survive this jump? Yes, they did. So, I would say it's confirmed that you can use 3D printed PLA spare parts in your RC car. <laughs> I 
If you like this video, hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. Bye!